Start using your KumbaCam Basic FPV kit. First attach the bracket to the bottom of the monitor using the attached screw and washer. Then remove the Allen bolt and set the washer from the bracket. Next, reattach it to the bracket on the controller hook using the included 2.5mm Allen key. Now plug the monitor charge adapter into the DC Plus port. Find the on-off switch on the side of the monitor and flip it to on. Once the display turns on and the boot sequence is complete, push the upper right power button switch to standby charge mode. The screen will go blank. There will be two red LED lights while charging. Once complete, the top LED light will go off. Using the FPV kit with a Phantom 1 charger or universal balance charger, plug the battery into the red power wire on the transmitter, making sure the colors are lined up, red to red, black to black. Then plug the GoPro cable into the side of the mini USB port of the GoPro. The mode and OK auto buttons have been disabled due to them having no effect or functionality. Now if you're using the Phantom 2 plug and play adapter, which is sold separately, remove the GoPro cable from the transmitter and replace it with the 5 pin connector from the PNP adapter. Next plug the PNP power into the power wire on the transmitter, lining up the red to red and black to black. Then use the included Velcro to attach the transmitter to the bottom of the Phantom 2. Remove the cable from the gimbal and plug the cable into the slot closest to the micro switch. Plug the attached cable from the PNP adapter into the Zenmuse gimbal. Use the included Velcro to attach the PNP adapter to the Phantom 2. Consolidate the wires to prevent any wires from coming loose. Lastly, Make sure the micro switch is set to VID.